Background? Background blah blah blah? Background, background blah blah blah. Oh yeah. I've been collecting for, I've been collecting for quite some time. Uh, to keep my sock pile up. For the rapture. <laughs> Cause the environmentally gay socialist. Uh, yeah, that's not my particular field of interest, but uh, uh, let me take a look. <laughs> this is really the one from the bunker. It's not loaded. I'm back in. <laughs> What's up, clutter luckers? How we doing, huh? This tiny, ugly piece of crap. So I guess we found my clutter school. <laughs> Decluttering is very important. I've been dealing with this my whole life. So every time that my room got messy or if I just felt like I had too much stuff, uh, we just moved to a different estate. You can always go back and visit your bungalows or condos or you know uh, places in Venice or Malibu Beach. I have a whole gym house, uh, gym with a G. <laughs> I'm gym with a J. I believe to declutter your life, leave everything because it's been in your life leave it in one space and make the new space where you can clutter it up again. That one time when my dad bought that place to put all of his cars, was it Rhode Island, I believe? Oh, so way, Senators, Populus, Quay Romanos. Hey, you antiquarian rascal. Uh, quid ages. No, quid ages. Oh, oh, so, all right, tell, tell me, what you got for me today? Did you bring me something special? Hey. Does Medusa make guys hard? <laughs> <laughs> I got something. I got something real special. Take a look at that. Oh, wow. Oh, tell me, is, is this the one? Well, it was mine. We all had our own. Except for Brutus. Hey, dumb student, he brought a club. So while we're all stabbing Julie, Brutus is whacking him on the head. Oh, see, I never heard that. Swear to Jupiter he did. He cracked Caesar's head wide open. And people say he said, he too, Brutus? When it was really more like, Oh, Oh, see, you know what? This is the sort of stuff they need to teach in school. Brutus made up his last words when we were out lunch afterwards. Get this. We were all having salad. And I says, hey, you know what we should call this? <gasps> oh, so you're the one who named it. Hey, this year. <laughs> and Julie, he always smelled like eggs and anchovies anyway. <laughs> 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 So what do you think I can get for that? I don't know. I think I can move it. It is with the greatest of feigned enthusiasm that I welcome you here to Clutter Lock. Hello. So, what item from the detritus of your maudlin middle-class existence have you brought here for me to look at today? I have brought something special. This statue has been in my family for generations, said to be worth a ton, but no one has been allowed to sell it because each time it's inherited, it must be passed on to the next child. Since I'm an only child and can't have kids since the uh, tetherball incident, uh, finally, it can be sold. After nearly 200 years, I could cash in on this, my family legacy. <sighs> that is the most colossally boring story I've heard all day. However, Looking at this item, I have to say, is quite thrilling. <laughs> Gazing upon this item, oh, 
It sends chills and electricity from my skull straight to my scrotum. <laughs> my toenails are tingling. I am positively lactating at the prospect of informing you about this marvelous piece. Tell me, tell me it's worth millions and I get to quit my job selling doorbells door to door. It is a magnificent phony. It is a forgery. It was made to look like a genuine sculpture from the French master Jacques Lestra. But it is an early 20th century fraud, a phony, a fake. <laughs> it's worth peanuts. <laughs> Thanks for coming. Wait. You blithely tell me my precious heirloom, the one thing I've waited to raise me out of the bubbling cauldron of pus of poverty I've been mired in is not genuine? You, sir, are the fraud. How dare you trespass on my kingdom? I rule here, sir, only I in this antique domain am king. Now I banish you, be gone. So it is to be war between us. Be warned, Manfred Barney. In the name of my ancestors, I will have my revenge on you. Bring it on, Philistine. Next.